Hi guys, welcome back. Um, I haven't been showing hardcore mode much love lately. Um, because I've been doing so much on my Let's Play world. So I thought it would be a good time to come back and see what's going on here. If I seem a little out of it, I'm very sorry. <laughs> um, I, I've had a rough day, so it's actually 12.30 in the morning right now. And, uh, I woke up like an hour ago from a seven hour nap, so, because I wasn't able to sleep at all last night, and today was my first day at my new job, so, working at Burger King, it's not fantastic, but it's, uh, or it's not very prestigious, but it's a fun job. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, I got home. And did I mention that I didn't get any sleep last night? Because I didn't get any sleep last night. And, uh, that was rough. But the day went by okay. It was just once I got home, really, that I realized how exhausted I was. And, uh, laid down to sleep. <laughs> I was like, you know, I'm tired. I think I'll take a nap. And then I woke up seven hours later. <laughs> and, uh, I was a little surprised because I didn't expect to sleep that long. I need more wood because I have no torches now. <laughs> Can't believe I didn't even think to uh, grab some wood before I went cave diving and stuff. <coughs> oh boy, I'm never going to figure out how to get back down here. Alright, where am I? Okay, so I can just follow this down and then... Alright, I should be able to get back up, I think. Except it's nighttime and it's raining. <laughs> so that's a bummer. Wait, no. No. How do I get. No. I don't want to be lost again, guys. No. Wait, does this go back to my house? Oh, I think it does. Sprint. I haven't done any work on my texture pack, but I might actually just do that after I record this. Um. Because I want to finish that at some point or another. I don't have much coal on me, so I might as well just grab some of this. Um, I feel like I'm a bad person to uh, do to do a hardcore let's play, just because I'm cautious about everything, and that kind of <laughs> defeats the purpose. Like, I don't know. I like hardcore mode because it gives me a reason to be cautious. Because it's like, well, if you lose, then you lose, so you can't really just derp around all you like. Um, yeah, and uh, I don't know, maybe, maybe you guys agree with me, but I don't know. Post comments and stuff, guys. I'd like to hear from you. I only hear from like one or two of you, so yeah. But yeah, again, sorry if my commentary is a little subdued. I'm just pretty tired right now. <laughs> and, uh, still a little groggy. But do I have any wood in here? I have some, not a lot. There we go. And then this will be another five stacks of torches, so that's fine. I don't want to go back out there. It's raining, and it's nighttime. So, and it's lagging. Even better. Okay. <clears throat> now, where were we? Let's see. Here we go. Okie dokie, down the stairs. Run on over with more lag still? Okay. Video settings, particles, minimal. That really helps for me with uh, the lag that comes during rainstorms. So, uh, just letting you guys know that that does work pretty well. Okay, let's try coming up here. Oh, or not. There's a little space over here that I want to go to. Because I don't know if there's another way to get to it. I'm just kind of a way to get to it. Um, big cave, big cave, alright, that's cool. 
I like big caves. Oh, that sounded weird. Okay, skeleton shooting at me. Okay, really, dude? You're... Yeah, there you go. I was like, he should be in lava right now, but he wasn't, because he's stupid. There we go. Creepers aren't as annoying as skeletons are. Well, I shouldn't say that. Creepers are way more annoying than skeletons are, but they're not as dangerous. Because, like, creepers will blow up your stuff, which is really freaking annoying. But, um, I'm not afraid of them in combat. It's just, like, when they sneak up on you. Skeletons, however, are a different story. They like to get in the way, and, um, because it's like, they, they walk around you, so if you're trying to get past them, then it's just like, nope. I'm going to just, uh, walk right in front of you now. Oh, he's blown up. Thank you, Iron Armor. What is that? It's just a little, like, Hero Brine enclosure. <laughs> See what's down here. I will go back and mine stuff, particularly, like, on my way out, most likely. Um, oh, there's an Enderman getting all upset because it's raining. Hello there. Don't shoot me. Oh, Alright, it just comes out here. Good to know. D oh, does that mean that, uh, there may be a thing back there that, um, I have a little cave that I, you know when I cross that little gap, um, to see if there's anything behind it? Well, there was that little cave, but I just assumed that that this cave met up with it, but it might not. But this is going up, so it looks like it might end soon. Or not. Or it's just going to get into more of these creepy little holes. That's weirding me out. Just because they're like perfectly human sized. Okay, I'll explore that later. I think that might just be like the same cave that um, I was looking down on from over here. Alright, let's see. Come back through here. Come back up here. Where was it? Where am I? Hi, Enderman. There's gold over there that I missed. What the? Did the Enderman take that block? <laughs> from behind the corner? Oh my god, so I was playing on my Let's Play World, right? And, um... You know how I told you that, uh... When creepers blow up, I just cover the hole with, uh... I, I dig out all the sand and then cover up the hole with cobblestone and then just... Cover it over with sand again? So that way it looks normal, but it's... It's actually a hole with, um... Some torches underneath it. And, uh... So I was fighting some Endermen one day, and... I hit one, and he teleports away, and I was like, where'd he go? There must be some cave underground or something that I just don't know about. And all of a sudden, one block of sand disappeared. Like, one of the sand blocks that I was, sta like, standing near just dropped down a block. And I was like, oh my god. One of the Endermen teleported into the hole and then picked up one of the sand blocks from the bottom of the sand stack and made the rest of them drop. <laughs> and I laughed so hard because I've never seen that happen before, like picking up sand from the bottom of the pile, and it was just awesome, because I knew exactly where he was because of it, but, but yeah, it was cool. Okay, I forget where this goes. I think this just goes back around to where I came from. Sorry for doing mining on, on screen, like, getting all the gold and stuff. I should really learn not to. Um, oh, right, this is the... Alright, yeah, so I'm not gonna go down there. Oh, well, actually, no. The zombie, oh, actually, that zombie might lose. Usually zombies win in skeletons against, in fights against skeletons, but... I don't know, maybe not today. Oh, no, there you go, he won. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna pause the recording and start 
uh, section two. So I'll be right back. Or part two. Whatever. And we're back. Oops, sorry. <laughs> I accidentally had my mic up. Um, because on my headset, um, the, you know, well, it's a regular headset, and the mic lifts up and down, so, it's actually a Razer headset, I forget, I forget the name, and or I don't know how to pronounce it, <laughs> um, like, of the actual headset, I think it's Garcharius, I don't know how to say it, really, um, but, yeah, that worked out well. What's up here? Um, nothing. All right. Whoa. Push a little bit there. Okay. Oh, there's a cave over. Oh no, there's not. <laughs> okay. Is there a zombie spawner here? Cause I can hear them, like crazy. It's not just that one. Is there more up there? Okay, well, there's something somewhere. Because I can hear skeletons making noise. They're just definitely zombies making noise. And creepers somewhere. Hello. Ah! Arrow just whizzed by my head. Ow! Butthead. Oh, here we are. Well, that's neat. Okay, cool. So that that cave did come around over here. I was worried it wouldn't. Nah, stop it. Too cool for you, noob. All right. Mm, oh, whoa! I'm pretty sure that went through me. Just saying. <laughs> did anybody else see that? Um, I'm pretty sure that just went right through my face. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Looked like it to me. Um, so as far as I can tell, by all means, I should have gotten hit there, but, you know, I guess I'm not going to complain if the game wants to give me a free pass on damage. Get away from me. Get away from me. Stop it. They're shooting at me. Ow! How the heck are you hitting me? See, that one skeleton couldn't hit me even though he shot me, like, directly in the face, yet these guys, he managed to hit me through walls. And apparently shoot, like, super fast. Okay, seriously, is there a skeleton spawner down here? I mean, they're fighting now. Seriously, that's like six skeletons. Six skeletons. That's a tongue twister or something. Alright, zombie down. This way is clear. Um, I'm on hard mode, right? Oh, I'm on hardcore. It's gotta be on hard mode. Um, there was one episode of my Let's Play that I was accidentally on peaceful. Um, like recently. I don't remember which one it was. Oh, it was after we came up from the... Um, I believe it was after we came up from the mine shaft, or the the abandoned mine shaft. Um, I had switched over onto my. Uh, all right, <laughs> I heard another arrow fall, and it wasn't this one because that one had already fallen. And then I heard another sound, and I was like, "All right, must be getting shot at," but apparently not. Um, but yeah, there was one episode where I came back up, and I was on peaceful, and I was thinking like, I was I was talking about how one time I came out and there were mobs everywhere. And I'm sitting here talking about mobs being everywhere in this area, and there's no mobs. And I thought it was a little weird at the time, but I didn't really think too much of it. Um, it's because I swapped to my my test world with all the wool on the ground and everything. Um, which I did download that. It's just flat wool all the way through. Um, it's just so much easier. I think I talked to you guys about something like about wanting to do something like that at the very beginning of my Let's Play. Um, because the world I had was getting annoying. I was building platforms everywhere to build my redstone things on, and um, platforms just like didn't have enough enough space. So 
Um, I just kept having to make more and more and more platforms until like I was covering over the ocean with them. And it was getting a little ridiculous. Oh, diamond. <laughs> like I'm just like, oh, all right, diamond. That's nice. You know, no fantastic, super excited anything. Just, oh, look, diamond. I mean, it. this Let's Play probably won't see so many diamonds because I'm going to be having to find the diamonds first. But um, on my other Let's Play, and like in most regular worlds that I make, I usually uh, find lots of diamonds because I mine for them. So... And redstone too, which is nice. Don't fall in the lava. I'd like to keep you. See, I found useful tactic when you're near lava is take your diamonds and put them in your hotbar. Because that way you can just, uh, if you do fall in lava, or like you know you're going to die near lava, you can just throw the diamonds somewhere on the ground that's safe. <laughs> um, because one time I did fall in lava, and I knew I wasn't going to survive, so I just threw my diamonds onto the, uh, oop. I threw my diamonds onto the uh, stone nearby and managed to come back down and save them. Not much else survived, but I did manage to keep the diamonds, so I think that's a pretty useful, useful tip. Um, let's see, yeah, there wouldn't be any more diamonds here, so let's grab some of this redstone and, oh, oh no, my pick broke. Oh, okay, I've got a second one. How convenient. See, that's why you're that's why you prepare in advance especially if you're doing a let's play because if I run out of uh, iron picks right there I'd just be like all right well I guess I'll just have to go back to the surface now have fun watching me walk all the way out but nope I already have my stuff here I could make a, an iron pick and I mean a diamond pick and just gather some of this obsidian but I'll come back for it later um, off camera probably well see I don't want to do things off camera because I feel so guilty doing it. <laughs> like I'm cheating on you guys or something. Okay, there's another zombie here somewhere. And I don't know where. Which frustrates me. There's a bunch of iron in the ceiling. Which I, know, I have plenty of iron. If I need more, I'll just know that there's just some here. Um, <laughs> I'm never getting back down to that obsidian. What am I talking about? I can say I'll go back, but that doesn't mean I'll find it. Okay, now for direction number two. Nope, there we go. Oh, but it doesn't look like there's anything this way. Or there is. And I'm a liar. There's a big hole to the sky. Sky. I just said sky. Maybe you didn't notice. Maybe you did. I don't know. I talk funny when I'm tired, or just regularly. <laughs> um, I guess I always talk funny, so it's not really that much, much news. Okay, you, no, shut off. There we go. All right. Now grab some of this iron. Okay, we already went up there. Oh, lag. No, no, we're good. Oh, that's interesting. I came out right there. And I already explored this way, it looks like. Where does this go? Out? Another ravine? <laughs> oh, this is that first ravine. Alright. I'm just gonna light it up down here little bit. I'll just make it so that it's less dangerous to be down here. Hopefully. At least a little bit less dangerous. Alright. Now, where the heck is my home? Alright, this is how I got here. Um, this way. And just in time, too. That whole adventure lasted about uh, 19 and a half minutes. So... <laughs> There you go. Um, let's see, I'll get some of this iron cooking. Stick that in there. 
put that there. Store my diamonds. Uh, my chest is full, so I'll make another chest. I hate at the beginnings of my games, I always have, like, my stuff gets organized once I've got a lot of it. So, like, once I have enough stuff to actually organize it, then I start organizing it, which means I have this entire mess of a chest first, which gets pretty annoying, but oh well. Anyway, so I gotta go. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.